What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another YouTube video. I can't even fit this box in the whole frame because of how large it is. But here's a comparison to the standard indoor hotspot. I mean, I can't even show you guys how, how much bigger it is. It's like that much gap at the bottom. It's a pretty large box. I'm going to give you guys an unboxing as far as what is going on in this package when you open it up as well as a teardown of this as far as I feel comfortable going, which will pretty much just be opening this up just so you guys can see all the guts of it. I know a lot of people actually enjoy seeing that kind of stuff because you can see what's inside of it. It helped us determine which devices had Raspberry Pis back in the day. It's very helpful. Uh, so on the side, it's just cardboard and this is pretty much just a sleeve that goes on. Um, and then on the top or bottom, it's like the same thing. It's just this hot spot. And then on the back, it says the future of mobile is you. This is pretty similar to what it said on the indoor one. Uh, deploy coverage, mount it on an external surface with post poles or outdoor fixtures oriented towards areas where people congregate. It tells you the specifications. It is IP67 rated waterproof, uses less than 20 watts, and it's PoE only. So it comes with the Helium Mobile Hotspot, the mounting bracket, the tilt and swivel mount, and an RJ45 cable gland. So let's take the sleeve off and unbox this device. All right, with the box open, I'm actually hitting the light. That is used. I can't even actually have this box open here. We have a bunch of stuff. First off, information pamphlet, pretty standard. What is pretty much I could bet is just gonna have a QR code. Bang, QR code and all the important compliance information on the back. So we can set that aside, not really important. See what we got here. We got a oh my god, <laughs> that is a sturdy mount. All metal, uh, powder coated, looks like. And this would be so that you can mount it onto a pole, it looks like, which is nice. You don't have to go out and buy this kind of stuff. You do have to buy a pole, though. As well as this, which is another mount, which is specified on the back of the box what it's for. I forget what it is. But, oh, this is the swivel mount. Okay. So, pretty neat. Tells you the, the degrees on it already etched in. Uh, and that would mount to a wall uh, on the side of the house or something like that. So, set that aside. And these are heavy duty mounts. And then we got, this is the RJ45 uh, water tight connection. We got some mounting hardware. I hope this is like stainless steel, but it looks like it's just normal. So it will probably rust. And then in here, I would assume, all right. Yeah, we got some tie downs. So we got some hose clamps. Uh, it just comes with two hose clamps. I don't know how big these are, but obviously they can just be cut and tightened down to your desired uh, liking but it's nice that they give you pretty much everything except a, a pole and power obviously you're gonna have to go out and buy your own poe injector so let's see how we can get this thing out of here all right this is pretty heavy we got a bunch of screws on this i don't know if i really want to take this apart i probably will just to show you guys what's going on We got this little nub here, probably for moisture release. I don't know exactly how outdoor enclosures work because the ones that I've had, I've built myself. It's cool that this is, uh, this is the first one I've actually purchased where it's completely contained. You don't need an antenna hooked up to this. It's all within this device. It's got a plastic front, hard plastic, so it is protected against the elements and it is watertight. However, it does have to be plastic so you can actually get a signal through this and the back is metal. So you would have your mount pretty much going like this, I guess. And then, yeah. So you can mount this to a pole or sideways, whatever you want, and then maybe put this like that and swivel it. I'm not entirely sure. I mean, makes sense, but screw it in there. Pretty cool, pretty cool how they have this configurable setup. On the bottom has your uh, connection here for your ethernet, your PoE, and it looks like this is just a closed cap because um, it's probably cheaper to just get two uh, simultaneous holes, make this whole thing symmetrical. So it says ETH PoE, there's a board in here I can't access, but what you would do is you pretty much screw this in and hook up your, your PoE, plug it into a wall somewhere, hook this up outside, and you can start earning. So it's pretty awesome. Um, this one was a little bit more expensive and I'm actually projected to earn less 
on this device versus my indoor one. So we'll see how that pans out over time. But I'm going to have these both set up and see what the earnings are like and make a review for you guys so you guys can see uh, if you're interested in picking one of these up. I don't have any referral links or anything like that, but I will have the link to these in the description so you guys can pick them up. I would recommend just getting them straight from Helium. It took about, I think, five or six days to get them shipped out to me. And no questions asked. I just had to sign for it at the door. That's it. So let me know if you guys have any questions. I will do my best to answer them as well as join my Discord. We can talk about it more there. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Peace out.